Hello, and welcome to the channel. I'm your host, D-Day, bringing you Enigmatica 2 Expert Endgame. <laughs> if you're enjoying the content, please hit a like, subscribe to see more videos, and most importantly, leave a comment. Thank you so much, and enjoy the show. All right, so we left off on uh, the Psy metal ingots. But I am not confident in this mod at all right now. So we're going to skip these three and save them to the end. So I can have some more time to study up on Psy. Uh, we'll jump straight to the next one, which was the Fluxed Electrum. So let me teleport to the space station real quick. Let's go, let's see, Flexed Electrum. Flexed Electrum, we have a stack. Next up is Ironwood and Fiery, yeah. So I remember we put the Flexed Electrum in and we stopped at Ironwood because uh, I didn't have enough in the system. So I pulled and changed my uh, my filters in my mob farm and now I should have repurposed a lot of ironwood yeah there we go ironwood also have the armor set ready for when we craft the uh, the wyvern armors we'll keep going with that enderium lumium signalium the enderium <coughs> signalium Let's get some signalium going. Constantan bronze, Invar. Constantan bronze. We got the alloys going. These aren't that hard. Invar Invar Enderium Lumium. I missed Lumium. Enderium Lumium. Okay. Tin, copper, night metal. Lumium. Whoa, device offline, what's up with that? What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you why are you offline? Uh, <laughs> it's because I restarted the mob pack. The, the drives me nuts drives me absolutely nuts when I restart the mod pack without fail all of my tritium disappears it's driving me insane uh, let's go back space station absolutely insane it's only when I shut the mod pack down. I have full tritium, a full dynamic tam tank of tritium. Restart the mod pack, re-log in, all of my tritium is gone. Every time. I can't wait till I, I can make this creative tank, and I can make a black hole tank, and then I can just run DT fuel through the machine, and I'll never have this issue ever again. 
we were on Lumium. Okay, we need tin, copper, night metal. Tin, ingot. Copper. Whoa. Copper. Night metal. Night metal again is one of those that I've been running through the uh, the mob mob farm and arc furnace to get the the ingots. There we go. There we go. And there we go. Let's see what's next. We got cobalt, ardite, manulin, and then the one that I wanted to work on today. Perfect. Cobalt, ardite. What's great about cobalt and ardite is we're getting them uh, from the void ore miner and manulin, manny, manulin is just cobalt and ardite alloyed. Perfect. We'll put you back. And the next one is night metal, which is a really cool alloy, and I'm 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 excited. I like doing the alloys; those are fun. When I did primal mana, and when I did mirror, uh, which one was it? It wasn't Mirian, was it? I think it might have been Mirian. Cobalt, Ardite, Manulin. Night Slime, cool, and Pig Iron. These are both going to be kind of fun. So Night Slime and Pig Iron. Let's go Night Slime. I'll put you up here. And then let's also do Pig Iron. I'll put you up here. Cool, cool. Yeah, I'm excited. I like doing these because we're almost done. As soon as I feel a lot more comfortable with the Psy Metals, then I'll I'll do that one. Ardite Man Manulin, Night Slime. Perfect. So casting. We have to make the Molten and a Melter. We have to alloy it. It's Seared Stone, it's Liquid Purple Slime, and it's Molten Iron. So we're going to need three Melters. Let's go. That's seared gauges. We have three melters, but I want to use the melters from Nuclear Craft. I like these better because all they need is power. Three melters. We need ME Export Bus. Two more. And then we need power, of course, and we need the tanks, seared tanks. This one has starlight in it. This one is still full of Mirian. Let's go, we need an alloy tank. Is this one empty? I'm pretty sure it's empty. And then we need what? Three seared tanks for the fluids. And then we need a heater for the alloy. Harder. <laughs> heater. We have heaters. Cool. Seared heater. And then one of those wireless coils. Yeah, that I have an overabundance of. Perfect. We'll get those. Oh yeah, and then let's grab pink. Was a pink slime, right? Pink. I only need one, really. We need the iron ingot. Cool. What else was night slime made out of? Alloy, molten iron, and seared stone. It should just be straight up stone, right? Oh, you can melt grout into seared stone. Seared bricks into seared stone. Yeah, and then it's just stone, regular stone. Cool. Let's go stone. Like that. And then what was pig iron? Let's take everything with us. Pig iron is ingot former, molten pig iron, which is an alloy of clay, blood, and molten iron. Hmm. Hmm. 
Here I'm thinking about pulling the molten iron from the other setup, but I, I don't want it to get muddled up, so let's do three more. Go big or go big or go home. Three. Let's go. Number three. There we go. Three. I mean, export bus. Three. We need another seared tank. Three of these. We need another alloy tank. We need another heater. Another wireless cord that they obviously, uh, unfortunately, do not stack. Then it was flesh for the blood. Iron again, which I probably could repurpose, but it's fine. And it was, what was the last one for pig iron? Yeah, clay. Sweet. And that, I believe, is everything that we need. Let's put our spacesuit on. And head over here where we're doing our thing. And see, like what I was thinking is in this setup, we already have iron. So I was thinking like I could run a cable up high and then connect the iron. This one has Mirian, Osco glass, and uh, IC2 coolant, which I repurposed. Hmm. Iron, aluminum, and obsidian makes the aluminite. We've been running that guy too. Cubic boron nitrite. Let's see. And now I'm going to have to run another cable. Hmm, should I? Should I not? Hmm, part of me wants to. But nah. Let's go ahead and put these down over here. So we got melters. And we need... ME conduit. And I'll set this up along the wall here. And one up. Purple. We need one of these. Now we need three of these. ME conduit. One coming out. And to the side. And to the side. One coming out to the side and to the side and then we need the ME export buses this 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 into the melters here here and here The melters need fluid cables. One, two, one, 
one, two. I need the, the wrench to detach these guys. Detach and detach. We need the tanks. Or actually, let me keep going with what I was doing. One, one, one. The ends need one more. Wrench, wrench. We need the tanks next. There, there, there. There, there, and there. We're going to detach the sides here. We're going to do an insert here. Insert here. Insert here. And then an extract here. Always active. Extract here. Always active. And an extract here. Always active. We're going to detach these. Insert. 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 Extract, always active. Extract, always active. And extract, always active. And we'll grab our alloy tanks in the middle. They need heaters under and under. Inside we'll put the wireless RF heating coil. Before I forget let me do wireless. Grab one of these guys. The wireless RF transmitter and I'll put that guy in between so it reaches them. Then the alloy is going to go into ingot formers. We already have one. Ah, oh, I don't have it on autocraft. Let's see what I'm missing. I'm missing four basic platings and a machine chassis. I'm missing tough alloy. Let's see, can you make a hundred? Is that too difficult? Nah, you can do it. One of those, ingot former. Basic platings. Give me four. Ingot former. So I need two more fluid. There. There. And then the ingot former here. And here. Do an extract. Always active. And an insert. And an insert. And an all extract always active. Cool. Now this one is going to be pink slime, iron, and stone. And then this guy is going to be rotten flesh, iron. And clay. I need points for power. Let's go. Four. We need flux cores.
point. We need four. All right, I'll give you one. I'll give you one. I'll put you in the middle. And I'll put you in the middle. Energy. There and there. There and there. I got six channels. Let's go. Let's remove this one. We can remove this one. ME conduit. Let's see. Run you along the top. Come on, lag spike. There we go. Six of eight channels. Six of eight channels. Stone, seared stone, iron, molten iron. You making pink slime, buddy? Seared stone, molten iron. Hmm, there we go, first problem. Night slime. Alloying liquid purple slime in a melter. Oh, it's a slime ball, not a purple slime. So liquid purple slime comes from this slime ball, which is congealed purple slime blocks. Hmm. It's a different purple. That's so it's slime ball, not congealed. Let's see. Pink slime. It's purple slime. Ha <laughs> ha. Miss red. It's not pink slime. It's purple slime. Let me see. Do I even have any purple slime? I haven't done any. I haven't, haven't done that many of the the islands. Don't have any purple slime. I might have some purple slime in the overworld. Let's see. Melter, you're making clay. You're making iron. And you're not making this alloy either. Clay, iron. Let's see. Pig iron. Which one is it? Blood. Yeah, rotten flesh. Oh, can you not do it in a nuclear craft melter? Is that the problem? That's goofy. All right, I'll roll with it. I'll remove you, and I have the melter right here, and the melter is going to need where I know I have a tank. Yeah, 
Liquid Starlight. So let's see, can I just straight up switch you out? You're not going to need power now. So I'll put the Starlight down, and I'll put the Melter on top. There you go. Are you still set to Extract Always Active? Nice. And are you still exporting Rotten Flesh? Cool. Two of eight channels. So it's trying to fig find the, the channel first. I know it has it. Two of eight channels. Zero of eight channels. Let's go. Remove you just real quick so that it can catch its channel again. Three of eights, two of eights, three of eights. Now are you gonna export? There you go. Exporting. It's melting it faster than it can export, cool. Acceleration cards, overkill, there we go, pig iron, oink, we got pig iron coming in. This purple is what was uh, kind of silly to me. Let's go home. Let's find some purple slime. Maybe we can do our trick where we put the purple slime in a compactor. All right, my ender book. Sorting facility. Do we have any purple slime in here? Purple? We have purple slime saplings. Get rid of this. Ah, oh, these are green ones. see purple slime saplings only grows on slimy dirt this is slimy leaves but these come out green let me see oh hey hippocampus you're a little far from from your little pond slimy dirt Let me grab it from the other system. I know I got it. Slimy. Slimy dirt. Come on. Please load for me. Let's see. Mm, let's do three apart. There we go. Three apart. Purple slime saplings. Let's see, can these be bone mealed? Can slime saplings be bone mealed? That I do not know. Doesn't look like, no, there it goes. Oh, yeah. They can be bone mealed, but let's see. Even though they're purple slime, 
They're coming out with green slime blocks. Let's see, purple, what are these called? Slimy leaves. Nah, my best bet is probably to find a slime island real quick. Let's see, I'm gonna let it load like this and I'm going to look at my mini map to make this go quicker. See where the floating islands are. Because when my mod pack crashed and I had to reset everything, I lost everything that I explored on my maps. Unfortunately. Slime Island. That's not a purple slime island, though. Nope. Green? Yeah, green and blue slime island. Green and blue. They're not hard to find. They're pretty much everywhere. Mm -hmm. Like Spike. My computer is not going to like me rendering all these chunks. That's for sure. Let's see. Come on, Slime Island. Another green one.
Wow. It's still green. Yep, green. Come on, purple slime. Got a lot of green ones. Yep. More green. Yoink. Grab the hippogriff. Dude, all of these green islands. Stop. My kingdom for a purple island. Weird, why are there so many rainbow fairies here?
Come on, dude. Dude, this whole loading into trees shit is getting really annoying. really wish I hadn't lost my map so I could just go to the nearest island I saw.
Yes. Thank you. That took forever. Finally. Purple Island. All right, let me, I'm pretty sure I can use the, my pick on this. So let's see, purple. Nope, that is not the tool. No, no. Oh yeah, no, it worked. Oh, okay. 45. Let me grab all of it while I'm here. Grab this. Grab some of that. Okay, let's go. Cool, blue slime sapling, I wanted that. Now I can add that to my Line up. Keep these out. All right, home. Uh, let's go straight to the space station. Those are pretty rare. So one thing I'm curious, these guys can be broken down. Okay. And let me see if this works. So now, slime, we have 200, we have 268 of the purple. So let's grab from the blue a stack and we'll put it into the purple. And now we have 844. We'll grab two from the blue and one from the pink. Put that in there. And now we have 2,000. I'll grab one more from the blue or two, since I can make those in the uh, duplicator. Give that to purple. And now we have 3,724 purple. I'll keep one to eat. It's gross, but. Not eaten yet. I'm not. Yuck. Okay. Spacesuit. And now, instead of pink, let's do purple. Sweet, and you're working. Melting purple. Molten night slime. Molten night slime. There we go. And we got a stack of pig iron. Let's get a little happy.
Bam, 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 bam. Stack. And now we can finish the episode off on a good note. Skynet. And what was that? Night Slime and Pig Iron. Night Slime and Pig Iron. Perfect. So that episode was a little rushed and a little forced, but I'm glad we knocked out Night Slime and Pig Iron. We can continue on. We're almost done with the ultimate ingot. Thank you so much, and tune in tomorrow.